today we are doing our last training in Akron, Ohio. And this is her first client. So we're gonna watch her do her isolation and bonding technique. You okay? Uh-huh. Are you getting sleepy yet? Uh-uh. <laughs> Let's see. That's why he's gonna put some in there. Yep, we're gonna actually remove that one real quick for a dry. I heard that's a lash that's starting to slant, so that's all I was saying when they start slanting a little bit. Mm -hmm. So you don't even have to focus on one that you see is slanting first. You focus on the, the straight one first, and we'll go into either one. Okay. So let me just find you a good one. Like, that's in the middle. You got a couple good ones over here. See? Okay, that I see. One. Yep. Mm -hmm. Remember to try to slide it, do like a slide. I think I just, it's just, um, I need to go a little closer, but I'm, but it is, so I'm a little nervous about see. going closer. You're fine, it's not gonna, it's not gonna poker or nothing. And then you use, you're going to use a little less adhesive now. First you was fine, but I can see it's a little more. It's a little thicker. Mm -hmm. okay. So. There you go. i have you do a couple before I check the other one. Let's see. <clears throat> About the top layer ones, do you think those are fine to do? Yeah, what you're gonna do with her, you're gonna only do the top ones. Don't go inside the deep ones, cause like I said, once you do them, I'm gonna show you how you actually go in when they have that. Cause hers will give kind of a volume look just because she has so many layers. So you just focus on the medium ones that you see at the top layer of her eyes. Mm -mm, I'm gonna let you go. <laughs> Cause once y'all get in y'all zone a little bit and y'all don't make me stop, keep looking at all of them, cause it brings a nervousness for some reason. Every time I look at one, cause you'll feel like I'm gonna critique it. And then some of them be fine. You don't even mess up. You just be in your head. <laughs> oh, you know what I forgot? <laughs> I don't have no, no eye stuff, but normally tape adhesive uh -huh. breaks out my skin. <laughs> Do you feel itching or anything right now? No, it don't never itch. It don't itch. Okay. I could just, I mean, I just had to have something removed on me, and, and I had the doctor put tape on it. Well, because you had to put something on it. 
you know what I'm saying? But mm -hmm. he probably would have had to put like paper tape on it or something. So do you use that. Usually they'll use like that gauze stuff. You know, like when you mm -hmm. go get blood drawn and they could either wrap your arm up with something or they put tape or band-aid. They can't put the band-aids on me on tape and stuff. So do you think you need to remove this off of you before you off have a rash? Mm -hmm. I ain't never had it on my eyes. It, I don't know what it would do. I just don't, I just want to make sure you What kind of tape is it? Just it's regular? similar. It's like it's like a medical grade tape, like the tape that they use when you get wrapped. Like oh, yeah, it might it might do something. Because if that yeah. is gonna bother you, adhesive. Yes, adhesive. Keep your eyes closed. Allergic. I mean, yeah, don't open them. Okay, because if that's the case, you can use an eye patch. I just don't want you to have any kind of breakout. Yeah, because that. But yeah, that so after she apply that, we go dry you a little bit, and then you go put an eye patch on instead. Yeah. I just thought of it too. I'm sorry. That's okay. Remember how I made my skin on the side, Brandy? Did you see it? Yeah, and it was ugly. <laughs> well, we don't want that on your eyes. All right. I just forgot. I did, too, because I didn't Because I can't. I'm allergic to any type of, um, what do you call that? Um, and I should know, because I draw blood. We use those tourniquets and latex. Mm-hmm. Latex mm -hmm. and adhesive. Okay, we'll do a little pause. And this is, once again, our training in Akron. If you want to book for your last training, you can give me a call, 225-800-SKIN, or you can check us out at lovelytouch.com. Also the same on Facebook, Lovely Touch. That's lovely, spelled L-E-I-G-H, and Instagram also.